we've spoken about it. Onyeka finally apologized to us. These two in the house, these two lawyers trying to explain how it happened, trying to push the blame to someone else before going ahead to accept apology, trying to explain themselves, give a point why what happened happened before trying to accept the apology. Too much grammar for something that they are too uh, conscious of. Too much drama for what two adults did. Because Onyeka is not to be blamed for having or developing feelings for Ozzy, neither is a uh, Ozzy to be blamed for leading Onyeka on because there are two did the action simultaneously. But it is what it is that Onyeka was the one that folded. Onyeka seek for the forgiveness. Onyeka apologized to Ozzy. But Ozzy was the one that went to Onyeka for the conversation. And when Onyeka apologized, he was like, it's fine. I expected more from you because I care. So right now he cares. Then why was he making it look as if Onyeka was the one that is being pathetic? Because Onyeka was trying to secure and guide what she liked. Ozzy went ahead to say that his only offense was having two friends in the house. Well, that was not just your offense. Your offense was leading Onyeka on. Because Ozzy actually did that. Why would they, the way he was seen, you know, cuddling up, always having a soft spot for Onyeka. And he went ahead to do the same to another person. How do you expect this gender, you know, not to feel something or not to see it the other way around? They are females and they are not men. So some of them, it might have gotten to your head and make them to start overreacting. Just the same way Onyeka started reacting and, you know, started guiding what is hers. Ozzy was like, if Victoria was looking at you somehow, it was not because of me. Ozzy is just trying to deny the fact that he didn't lead Onika on. That he was not the one that, you know, that nurtured or made these uh, feelings to develop in Onika's head. But it is what it is. Apology has been rendered and everyone is cool. Are they going to come back together? We don't know that yet because Onika wants to live her life. She just wants to be happy in the house and be able to relate to anyone. She doesn't want to be the villain in anyone's story neither does oc want to you know lead anyone on again or be in that kind of drama because he has a woman outside that he wants to respect and he doesn't want to you know disrespect her in the national tv so guys now you know that oc and onyeka are no longer fighting and they've apologized they made up share your thoughts in the comment section what you think about the apology and these two fighting because there there's there are still some things that they are not yet agreeing on on the fact that they have both developed feelings for each other. They are still running away from that fact. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Thank you for watching to the end. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I'll see you on the next video. Bye.